Um, so we're here at Sonnet's Fair this weekend, um, and you're here this weekend with Crocodile. <laughs> Indeed we are, yeah. So awesome. how are you doing today? Really good. So I've had an absolutely amazing day. It's been a lot of fun. Like, the show was fantastic. Um, been hanging out, obviously, with my mates, which is always good, and drinking some beer, so what more do you want? Yeah, it's literally the perfect day right there. We've got sunshine as well, which is such a rarity that that's what we have, and I can totally feel it now. <laughs> you are kind of going a little bit pink, actually. You can tell yeah. that it's definitely... <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of feeling it as well. Like, the heat is emanating from my face right now, <laughs> but big time. You need to, like, slather yourself in after sun and, like, hide in a dark corner somewhere. I'm going to drench myself in after sun later on, yeah. Got to be safe. I love that stuff. I, I do, actually. Oh, yeah. I love Everyone's that Everyone's a bit after sun. Yeah. yeah. Can't, can't beat it. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's got to that stage on the Sunday, actually, where I'm just starting to check that to shine. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I love I've got it. Like, yeah, just go with it, it'll be fine. <laughs> Definitely. Um, so how was the set today? Absolutely awesome. It's, like, brutal. Like, it couldn't have been any better, actually. Like, we oh, wow. we feel like everything's really tightened up now and we've got our flow we've, as a band and everything kind of, yeah, works really well. And, yeah, it went so good. The crowd's seem to be into it which is always a plus uh, <laughs> kind of <laughs> it's what you want helpful. yeah yeah absolutely um, and yeah it went really really good um, totally buzzing off it's still buzzing off now actually to be honest with you so uh, it was great as well because like um, Brent from uh, Mastodon was there to watch us as well which was kind of because he came beforehand and um he came up to the back of the uh, the stage and he was just like, oh, hi, I'm Brennan. I'm like, oh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> I know you are. Um, Can I recognise you just a little bit? Yeah, just a bit. And he was like, have a good show and everything. And then as soon as we came off stage um, after playing, he was just like, yeah, dude, awesome. And that, which obviously was like, that's a really nice compliment. Yeah, yeah. yeah I mean, like, you just really can't ask for anything more, actually, when it comes yeah, to it. It's I mean, really, really dude, good. Mastered on watching your band is quite, yeah, it's quite something, to be fair. So, yeah, it's ace. Well, congratulations. That's really, really yeah. good. Um, and crowd-wise, I mean, was it, was it people that you've never seen before or was it people that you've all seen through various incarnations of various bands that have kind of come together? There was a handful of uh, friends I could sort of see doing certain signs towards me, you know, you know, to try and put me off, I guess. But, uh, but yeah, it was all fresh faces again um, and new people who, you know, I, I guess that some people may have kind of heard stuff that's been going on throughout the year, like the single, but maybe there was hopefully just people, as you do, like who wandered into the tent and were just like, oh, what's this? Like, and kind of checked it out and hopefully they'll walk away thinking, yeah, that was awesome. I'll try and follow that band up and see what's happening with them. Yeah. Um, and I mean, you guys. I mean, I think everybody kind of brings in their own fan base from different bands that you've all been involved with. Yeah. Um, I mean, do you would you think that that's mainly Crocodile's fan base, or have you actually found that you, you're kind of bringing in a completely new dimension of fans with this? I think there's a bit of both, really. I think obviously, you know, when like Lags has come from Gallows, and you know, Dan and uh, James have come from Sixth, and mm -hmm. they've kind of obviously pulled people in, and mm -hmm. you know, because they, they will they do have diehard fans. You know, I, I would say I'm one of those people that I love their band so much, and. But I think that, yeah, people will come and maybe, you know, they're not always necessarily going to like what we're doing because obviously it's a bit of everything together, but um, obviously that people seem to have taken to it and, uh, yeah, it's nice. That's brilliant. Well, I'm really, really glad. I mean, it's, it's always fascinating when you start kind of something like this to see how it's going to be yeah, received. Yeah. And it's obvious that it seems to be working really well for you guys so far. We've been very lucky. We've had a lot of good things like come at us and, you know, good opportunities, basically. Uh, I think that, like... Hopefully the people have, you know, wanted to do that as well because they've heard the music and they thought, yeah, it's exactly what we want in our festivals or where it may be. Um, and, yeah, so it's going, yeah, it's been a good reaction to it. Brilliant. Well, I'm really, really glad. Um, and you, you brought out, like, a release for Record Store Day as well. And yes. that's, again, again, everything seems to have been really, really positive. Everybody seemed to love it. Um, and, it's, and it's lovely to kind of pair up with something like that as well. Yeah. I mean, is that something that you feel really strongly about? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, like... Um, it was a really nice thing to do because obviously anything I can get to put on my name on that's been released on vinyl is a complete. I love it. Like I'm a big uh, vinyl collector myself, so that was kind of a, yeah, a really important thing. But um, yeah, it was good. It's like a, obviously a limited press as well um, for it being record store day, uh, and it seems to have people have picked it up. And you know, we obviously put the track online as well, so people could who yeah. thought was because I know that the vinyl's not for everyone, but. You know, so they could hear what was See, going why on. not? Honestly, it's shocking. I don't get it either, really, but yeah. Did you know that when you die, like, there's a, there, there are companies out there that, that will take your ashes and then compress it onto a vinyl record of really? your choosing? Yes. 
I know, right? I, I'm definitely putting out my will in, yeah. Uh, you know, want some I cups, stick me in some vinyl, yeah. <laughs> I really, really want that to happen. I know it's like, everyone's like, but that's so morbid. And I'm like, no, 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 that's, that's amazing. Great. Especially yeah. then, would it be too cocky to have that on your own record? I don't know. I don't think so. I mean, it's your record. I mean, what, who, who else is better to have it on? And hopefully that would go down quite well, because then every time someone does a set record, they'll be like, he's actually... Yes. He's there. There yes. he is. Like, yes, they would. <laughs> yes, they would. Yeah. No, that would be, I think it's, I think that is a brilliant idea. Yeah, I kind of look into that, actually, I think, yeah. <laughs> I think they charge a fortune for it. I think it's about 10 grand. However, you will be dead, and so somebody else will have to so pay so for Someone's going to foot the bill, so it doesn't matter. I don't have to worry about that. <laughs> Yeah, I'm definitely putting that down, Brilliant. big time. Yeah, yeah. Um, in the next kind of six months or so, um, I mean, what's happening with you guys? What have you got on the cards? Uh, well, we've got the album finished now. It's all sealed. Yes, it's actually finished uh, the recording. Um, so that's going to be out in the kind of autumn, maybe September, October time. Um, so we get that out, and then obviously we can start the whole process, get some tours sorted, and there's some things in the in the pipeline which we're kind of really excited about, which we, you know, we can probably later on reveal, like. Um, but yeah, things are looking really, really, really positive, and yeah, we just can't wait. I mean, I just can't wait to tour this like album as well because we are super stoked on how it's come out and how it sounds as well. So, yeah, nice. Well, thank you so much for taking the time to chat. It's been a massive pleasure. pleasure. Um, I hope you kind of get to enjoy the rest of the festival. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Good luck yeah, with I'm gonna, that. yeah, I'm going to try and catch some bands now. I think, but, uh, wow, novel idea at a festival. Like. Exactly. Um, but thank you so much, and I have no doubt that we're going to see you. I mean, as soon as you get touring again. Yeah, look out for it, and uh, yeah, end of the year, and we'll see you all soon. Fantastic. Yeah. Thank you so much. You're welcome. No problem. <laughs>